Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss about how a laundry business laundry business means dry cleaning or ironing or any other relevant service business can use odoo so the typically the laundry business has to pick up uh, the clothes from the customer home and then give it to the store and store will process the services according to customer need and then they will again deliver so out of the box i have created the operations inside odoo the thing is like what i have done is i have created one operation type for the same like i am creating a receipt and then given its name as a pickup service and connected it with my one store i have two different warehouses and then default source location would be customer and destination will be our warehouse stock location so let's say i am creating i want to uh, you know uh, receive the inquiries and creating transfer for customer 1 where customer 1 is saying that please arrange a pickup let's say tomorrow around uh, 10 o'clock in the morning so this is the first pickup i am just planning and then i am using consignee so whenever the clothes coming into our warehouse it should not cover any costing and then here i am assigning my responsible users right the yeah, like this has to be planned by user one so it will save and create one pickup likewise i will create a second pickup for customer 2 i will be planning my schedule tomorrow and then giving him time around 10:30 a sign owner is customer 2 again and the product is clothes okay and i am assigning this to user 2 so this way you can see like user 1 user 2 the schedule is tomorrow and then the area is you know up cake Uh, the use case is uh, belongs to uh, the saudi area so i have selected by state i have uh, put this column by using studio as a state and then whoever is uh, you know users like assigned to i want to filter it like assigned owner is set so this is all responsible is set over here but i want to group by the assign owner so this is customer 2 and this is assigning owner of the consignment but like i want to see the responsible group by responsible so user 1 user 2 you can see responsible and the state should be ready so i am saying filter ready that only i would like to see and i have also set uh, the open street map so it can be seen according to the state and pin code so there are two pickups both belongs to you know similar kind so what i will do is i will simply click here and maybe assign the single user so i can save my time and both can be pick up by the single user so this will change the user and schedule will be tomorrow so consider i am on tomorrow right now and my user is going to customer 1 using his mobile app and navigating through map and then picking up let's say 20 clothes from customer 1 and simply validating it now he is going to like customer 2 also where he is picking up 30 clothes and just validate now if i see my location based stock so on here 20 and 30 belongs to customer 1 and customer 2 has been received to my stock location and now i have to register my sales order what customer 1 and 2 wanted to be so for customer 
I will first select how many clothes so it is a manual operation so I need to see how many clothes we have received from customer one so what I will do is I will simply go to my inventory and in operations I can see like customer one has been received 20 clothes so I will say 20 clothes which I need to deliver the unit price is not here because it is only a clothes I need to deliver back but here the main part is servicing so let's say customer is asking like do the dry cleaning services for all 20 clothes and it will cost 5 years to them and what I have done is I have set up the dry cleaning services mode as a service and it will create a task in dry cleaning service type project and I have also assigned the user who is going to perform according to their skill set so once I confirm this and then I will plan the delivery date also like after dry cleaning it should be delivered on let's say 15th so it will create the delivery accordingly and I confirm the sales order so you can see a task has been planned right and if I say plan orders it will automatically assign to user one who is specialized in dry cleaning services and he will perform the services and then on 14 it will deliver normally uh, currently it is calculated by hours so that's why we see 20 hours is going to take and the task has been created and delivery has been planned in future on 15th date schedule date so this is how uh, I can see the task is there for the task the assigned to is already planned so I can see in the project and when dry cleaning task is already there if I create the stage like in progress and then done and I can move and people will know in progress and then here is say it is ready and then whatever the information I need to put in people can assign over here and then once I say it is done I can put it done and it will mark on the ready stage so this is how my service will be performed and as soon as it is performed it will intimate uh, via mail uh, we can set up via mail and intimate our department of delivery like let's plan a delivery so in my inventory if i go on to overview here the delivery process has been planned and in delivery orders you can see user one i need to assign a, a representative and the schedule date is in five days because i have planned on 15th so i can now change schedule date is today because i am done with my services and then it is automatically reserved the 20 units from our warehouse only so if you can see over here you can see 20 units free stock is 35 from 15 other from other customer it has been reserved due to our uh, consignee option and then in, it is in ready state i can set quantity to 20 and say uh, the delivery boy is again you know i uh, can see by you know if i responsible assigned to my user one as a delivery guy and then group by responsible and filter is which is ready state and then I can he can go by map and he can perform by view in Google Maps and he can deliver the items so during delivery he will deliver the item and then once we go into our sales order again we can create an invoice and then collect the money we can confirm just an invoice so clothes will contain zero but this will be costing services and then we can register like cash payment which the delivery guy can collect the payment and the cash guy will register the payment so this is how we can uh, you know use a system for laundry business hope this helps uh, to ideate more in detail uh, to make some automated action email alert or sms alert based on all functionality thank you very much